Hi guys, Archie Luxury. Go to f2bbs.com. www.f2bbs.com. The last bastion of free speech on the interweb. That's right, guys. I want you to go to www.f2bbs.com. That's right. I want you to go there. You can, uh, this is a, a great site to fight against all sorts of nasty and nastiness by posting on f2bbs.com. The last bastion of free speech on the interweb. Go there, guys. Hey guys, it's your pontiff, Archie Luxury. Welcome to the new series, Rolex AD Lies. Rolex AD Lies. Today we're doing the the, uh, the episode, the first episode, Backroom Rolexes. Backroom Rolex. And before we start this discussion, let's do a quick Wist watch check Rolex Submarina Rolex Submarina date. This is like this is the new model, the 126610 LN. This is the one that everyone's trying to get. This is one of the hard to get models. Okay, let's jump in there. Rolex AD lies backroom Rolex. So guys, you've probably gone to your local Rolex AD. <clears throat> what do you got on display there? Well, you've got your solid gold day dates. Date just. You got mid-size. And you've probably seen a few ladies date just in solid gold. A little bit in two-tone. And very no, no steel. No steel, ladies, either. Okay. So, sometimes at the AD, they have display only stock. Display only. What is display only? Display only are the hard-to-get models. Like this Submarina. They have it on display so you can at least have a look at what it looks like. It also helps fulfill the dream. Does it really exist? Because there's no way in the world you, can, you seem to be able to get it. So what is the truth? What is the truth with the ADs? Now... I've actually got a few ADs as friends. These, sorry, I, let me rephrase that. I have fans who work for ADs and they've told me the truth. The back room is full of Rolex steel sports. All the hard to get stuff is in the back office safe. Let me say that again. Most of the ADs out there have the hard to get stuff in the safe. Now, the staff are not allowed to access this stock. The staff need permission. Any slightly hard to get sports Steel, two-tone, or solid gold, or platinum. Any steel, oyster perpetual, any steel, date just, any two-tone date just, you, they need permission to complete the sale. It all needs to be approved. Now, the reality is, a lot of the dealers have safes full of the hard-to-get Rolexes. They're in the back room. Interestingly enough, a friend of a friend of a friend of a friend, he has consistently told me, Arch, you know the dealer blah, 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 well, he doesn't have Rolexes in the back room. He's got nothing. 
It's funny, I've been repeatedly told this, and whilst I respect this gentleman, I respect this guy, I don't believe it. I'm sorry, I don't believe it. He may believe it, and it may have been told to him, but it is baloney. It is absolute baloney. Baloney. You know that cheap, nasty meat. The cheap, ma nasty meat from the butcher. The sausage. Baloney. That's what it is. It's absolute baloney. A lot, a lot. Virtually, they have every hard to get. The Steel Daytonas, the Panda Daytona, the Black Black Daytona. They have the Pepsi. They have the Batgirl. They have the Kermit. They have the new 41 mil subs. They're not available to regular punters. No, of course they're not available. But they are in the back office safe. One thing that is extremely interesting to note is that I have heard through the grapevine, heard it through the grapevine, and this has come to me from multiple AD sources, that they now will no longer, staff cannot, because sometimes they give staff incentives to buy watches from the AD, and now, any of the hard-to-get watches, no, no, <laughs> they cannot get any hard-to-get watch. When I say hard-to-get, steel sports, two-tone sports, steel ladies, you cannot get that. Staff are not allowed to get preference over customers. The only exception... 10 years of service, you can get one steel watch of your choice. That's correct. 10 years of service at an AD. And I got to tell you, it's pretty, pretty crappy because you'd be better off. You'd be better off going into another career which has a higher salary and just paying the gray market dealers the premium and getting the steel watch of your dreams. So I got to tell you, the myth, these ADs, they all cry foul. Oh, we don't have them. Oh, the reality is 95% of ADs out there have the entire range in the safe. They have the entire range. Pandas, Kermits, Hulks. Well, the Hulk is obsolete, but they still got them lying around. They have got them all sitting in the safe. All sitting in the safe. That's right, guys. All the hard-to-get stuff, it's there. The new Oyster Perpetual, you know, the fancy colors. They got a whole ensemble, whole suite of them. No problems. It's, it's, this is the reality. They have got everything you could possibly want. All the hot models. Do staff have access in the safe? No. That is strictly for the store manager to have access. And maybe the assistant manager. Normal associates are not allowed to access the safe. That's a security risk. Only the store manager or assistant manager are allowed to access the safe. And, and, and the reality is they got every model. It's in the back office. The back office safe has them all. Now, the reality is they're not stored in the box. They're in one of those plastic coffins. And that's the way Rolex ships the watches. The box is separately shipped to the watch in the coffin. So I got to tell you, in all honesty there, please, please, 95% of the 80s out there, they got Pepsis, Batgirls, they've got the new 41 mil submariners, dates, non-dates, two-tone, 
they got the solid golds, they got all the hard to get stuff, it is all in the safe. It is all in the safe, that's right guys, it's all in the safe. This is the reality, this is what's happening, so uh, uh, this is the reality, I'm sorry to say this, this is the reality, they're in the safe, they're not available to you or me, the dealer will bullshit. He will lie even to his best friends. He will lie to his best friends. Oh, we got nothing. We got nothing. It's all lies. They got him in the back safe. They got him in the back safe. They're not available to you. They're not available to me. They're in the back safe. Of course they are. This is currency. This is. These are worth a lot of money. The dealer knows this. He ain't been... He ain't giving that out. I'll talk about how, who gets them. We'll talk about wait lists. We'll talk about flippers. We'll talk about developing relationships in upcoming vids. It's a complete lie. The safe is full of all the hard to get roll eye. It's all there, guys. I'm sorry. The Rolex Submarina date. Probably the most versatile, the most famous, the most wanted watch of 2020. The Rolex Submariner. Absolutely stunning. I've gone for the steel model. I wanted something that could be worn every day. The businessman's delight. Look at the side profile. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. I've got to tell you, I am in love with this Submariner. Black on black. Does it get any, any better? Black on black. The Rolex Submariner. This is what the, the, this is just such a beautiful, look at the, I got to tell you, the Maxi, that just the whole thing, this whole thing is everything. The ceramic sub should have been from day one. Absolutely winner, winner, chicken, chicken dinner. Absolutely. And it's got the new clasp with the glide lock for easy adjustments. Absolutely winner, winner, chicken dinner hi guys Archie luxury and who do I recommend in America in America who do I recommend for quality pre-owned wristwatches David SW David SW David SW go to David SW.com he is the best the greatest pre-owned dealer in all of the United States of America David SW David SW David S.W. Hey guys, Archie Luxury. Who do I recommend for watches in Brisbane and Sydney? Vintage Watch Co. That's correct. Vintage Watch Co. In Brisbane Arcade in Brisbane and the Strand Arcade in Sydney. Vintage Watch Co. Brisbane and Sydney. Ronnie, I've known him since the late 90s. Ronnie is a top bloke Luke is a great guy vintage watch co that is who I recommend in Australia check out vintage watch co and the guys amazing range of watches they also do service and repairs vintage watch co that is where the pontiff goes you know some of my paddocks came from vintage watch co that's right guys vintage watch co